If I look in my trash, you'll notice that I have a font folder and I've got a TTF file in there. And when I go to empty it, I say empty and I get that error message. Now there's a couple ways to fix that error message. One is to restart your computer. A lot of times that works. But the quicker way is to actually go into Activity Monitor. So this is a program that comes pre-installed on your Mac. If you don't know where it is, I have it on my toolbar. You can go to the Utilities folder inside of your application folder. So go into your hard drive, go into applications, and then utilities, and it should be at the top there. Or of course, you can search Spotlight for Activity Monitor. Once you have Activity Monitor open, you want to look for this process called Quick Look Satellite. This is what is stopping your file from being deleted. It's basically saving it as a thumbnail and tricking the computer into thinking that it needs to be it's in use that it needs to exist or else our computer's not going to work which isn't true so once you find this process go ahead and just click on it and then go up to the gear icon up here at the top oops i'm sorry go ahead and click the x to the left which is going to force the process to quit so we're going to force quit the quick look satellite process and we'll give it a second and we want to make sure that there's nothing else with quick look so there's another quick look go ahead and uh, force quit that one as well we want to force quit all the quick look quick look processes and we'll wait till that gets quit out now I'm hitting Q there's no other quick look processes so I'm going to close activity monitor go to my trash hit empty trash confirm that I want to empty it and voila my trash has been emptied. We don't get the error message. It's that little quick look process which is screwing things up a little bit. So I hope this video helped. If it did, I would really appreciate a thumbs up here on YouTube. And if you wanna see more technology tips and tutorials, go ahead and subscribe to my YouTube channel. That's all I have for you for today. It's Anson from AnsonAlex.com.